Hey guys, so today I'm going to be unboxing Sephora Play for November. I lost my voice, I'm sick, I've been sick for like 4 or 5 days now, but this video needs to go out. I have no makeup on, I'm going to be doing a try on. Ooh, so Sephora is $10 a month. <clears throat> this is my last month with Sephora Play, at least for now. And it says Survival of the Chillest, and it comes with a 50 50 insider points when you go and shop at Sephora Play and then it has like a, a poster with everything that I got <clears throat> it says me o'clock and it has a girl meditating it's me o'clock I think it's kind of cute all right the first thing I see which I've already gotten in my birch box like way in the past and it's okay I guess um it's a dry shampoo it's a dry shampoo from um Amika like I said it was okay I'm not super excited to see it that's just me I feel like I've been getting a lot of dry shampoos and I'm kind of like thinking okay right now I'm over it <laughs> the thing with dry shampoos is you use it these sizes like one time like one and a half times it's not even enough to do two times so I feel like it's kind of a product I don't like to get just because it's it, I don't know it doesn't last very long versus like a sample of makeup that can be used a lot all right and the next thing I'm going to pull out is the perfume which is the foreplay always has a perfume sample on it and this one is called blush or my blush from Burberry. It reminds me of something, but I really like it. Each perfume that I've gotten so far, I've really liked. So yeah, I'm happy with it. I don't know how to explain it, but it's like kind of fruity but like in a very professional feminine way um it usually has like just if it describes it on here it says um a fruity and beautifully feminine floral fragrance that captures the vibe of strolling through a london garden um yeah i, I get that <laughs> fragrance family is floral top notes pomegranate and lemon middle notes geranium just apple rose petal Base notes, jasmine, and wisteria. Okay, so the next thing I see is Purity Made Simple Pore Extractor. Philosophy, no one is perfect, so but we can all be pure. Exfoliating clay mask. Very excited about that. It is, where is it? So it's a, a rich and creamy mask, clay mask. Instantly removes blackheads, exfoliates skin, and warms as it deeps cleans for visibly clearer skin and luxurious experience. Love getting skincare. I always mention that in all of my unboxings. Okay, the next thing is a is from Sephora and the Sephora brand. This is such a tiny little sample, so I'm kind of like irritated by that. Like it's from their actual brand. Why can't they give me a full size lipstick? Um. It says Sephora, Sephora, yeah. It's super tiny lipstick and it is red. I don't think I have a red this red or this bright and pigmented. I'm kind of excited about the color. Um, seems really nice. I will obviously use that when I do my try on. The next thing is a uh, Be Hydrated Honey Drop Pharmacy. What is this? Be Hydrated Pharmacy Honey Drop Lightweight Moisturizer. A luxurious honey infused face cream that nourishes and hydrates skin. Why? You'll love it. Who cares? Okay. I'm not going to read all that. But it seems like a really good size. And... Oh. Oh. That is so weird. It has like little beads in it. I don't know how like little beads in it. Like it would be an exfoliator. 
<clears throat> That's cool though. Doesn't really have that much of a scent. And the last thing is from Marc Jacobs. And it is volum Volumizing Mascara. A jet black mascara. Whoa, that wand is huge and thick. So excited to try that. Yes. <clears throat> so that is it. I <clears throat> am not as all impressed as I was last time. Um, but I am still very impressed with it. I think the only thing I don't really like is the dry shampoo, which I know I, I'll still get use out of it. And I know it's still not, it's, I didn't, it wasn't my favorite, like my favorite one, I already know my favorite dry shampoo, so why like try anymore is kind of the way I'm thinking. Um, I'll probably have to like mark this off that I'm not interested in it anymore. So yeah, that's it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and try this stuff on for you guys. Hey guys, so I am back and I'm going to go ahead and use this honey drop moisturizer with these beads in it which is really interesting like I said I already put moisturizer on but I need some more I'm so sick I don't know what's going on but like my skin is so dry it feels horrible um yesterday when I was doing my boxy term unboxing my hands were so red looking and like horrible so I don't know what that's about. I don't know if it's just being sick and not really being able to eat. Um, I don't know. But it feels really good. I just want to keep putting it on and on because my skin just feels so dry right now. It smells really good. feels really cooling. Okay. So this right here is the bag from last month from Sephora. And I got a bunch, I kept all of the products inside of it because I wanted to film a try-on for this also. And so I'm going to use both products from this month and last month. Because last month I got a bunch of face products. And I'll use that with the, my, the new stuff that I got. <clears throat> but here is, um, <clears throat> this is like a serum. And this is like a primer that I got in my last box. So I'm going to mix them both together. Very thick looking. Okay. And the primer, which is from Urban Decay. So I'm gonna mix them two together and rub it all over my face. They both feel nice. Both don't really have any scent to it. At least that I can smell right now being sick. So, Pal, that's on. Um, Makeup Forever HD thing. That's what I... If you're confused on what I'm using right now, just go to my last video that I uploaded last week. From um, And then the Urban Decay Primer. Okay, the next thing I'm going to use is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation. And I'm going to use pans so that way I don't use any... I don't waste any product because I... I didn't want to use it today just because I know that I'm not going anywhere. I know that I'm not going anywhere, but um, so yeah, I didn't want to use my beauty blender because I know I noticed that when I use my beauty blender, it kind of like I use more product. Okay, I feel some product like rubbing off, like it dried and it's kind of like coming off, so maybe I should have let stuff sit longer. I don't really have any blemishes right now, um, just the one right here. I'm gonna go look in the mirror. I'm just gonna put a little bit of, a little bit of uh, concealer, even though I'm not going anywhere, but my nose is so red from blowing my nose a lot. My, but my skin, you guys, looks amazing. It looks so smooth. My sister just went and um, purchased some like expensive makeup because she was like frustrated on like why things weren't staying on all day and she was like is it the primer is it the setting spray do I need to like spend more on those types of items 
and so she went on Ulta and spent like over a hundred dollars and didn't use my coupon that could have given me money <laughs> whatever sister <laughs> just kidding she didn't know but um but yeah I had a ten dollar off coupon for Ulta which would have gave me like, like ten off so I'm not really sure but um but yeah, but she went and bought like stuff like that just to see if it would help her makeup stay on longer. And she was like, Brittany, it actually works. You just need to spend money on things like that. Okay, so my skin's so dry right now, I'm not going to put any face powder. Okay, I'm back. So I'm going to put some blush on. This is from BoxyCharm. My sister gave it to me. I didn't actually get this month. The month I had this blush. But she gave it to me because she doesn't like any kind of redness in her skin. So she... Obviously, yeah, give it to me. I'm not going to go, like, overboard with this look today just because I know that, you know, I'm sick and I'm not going anywhere. <clears throat> I didn't use the clay mask that came in this month's Sephora because my skin's just so dry right now. I don't want to use any kind of exfoliating thing. And now I'm going to use um, DLS eyeshadow that I got in something. I think my Ipsy. Okay, so there's a bunch of like dog hairs in it because um I think it was either mini or Jack dropped it on the ground in my last video and Wes oh my god I just dropped, dropped it again okay so I'm gonna try and hurry up because Minnie does not look like he's feeling well and it's starting to scare me so um here are just some cover girl like chapstick stuff and it's amazing put it on my lips um now I'm going to put on this mascara from Sephora. This tiny, and all that's a lipstick. Oh my gosh, Brittany, get it together. Marc Jacobs mascara. Feels a lot like. The Lancome mascara, which I love, seems very, very similar to the way that it feels and that the brush feels. It's like the identical twin. Now let me go check it. In the mirror. I feel like the Lancome's comes a little bit better. So, okay, got it on the top lashes, and now I'm going to put some highlighter that is now my favorite highlighter, you guys. The best out there that I have tried. And it is from the Beauty Crop Glow Milk. It is like a metallic highlighter. And it shows up like crazy, crazy. I have a $38, oh my gosh, I put way too much up there. Whoa. Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, I'm trying to like, Manny. I mean, I'm trying to look in the camera and I'm not really, I put like way too much, you guys, but you know, just chilling in my house. So anyways, what else? Last thing, I think, the Sephora lipstick. Oh my gosh, you guys, that's gorgeous. I know I put like lip balm on, lip balm on just a second ago. Um, so I don't really know how I guess it applies without it. But I always like to do that. So anyways, you guys, I think that's it, right? Yeah. Um, tried everything on. The foundation, I'm definitely going to definitely gonna go check it out. The HD one that came in my last subscription. Um, the mascara is really good. The lipstick's really, really nice. Um, this feels really good. Everything was a total thumbs up. The dry shampoo, I'm not going to use it because I'm going to be washing my hair tomorrow. But, um, 
yeah so there's the final look you guys um i'll leave down the link down below where you can find sephora.com it's not a referral link but anyways you guys have a great day um don't forget to hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell we upload every single day we are daily uploaders oh i forgot something the tarte rainforest so, oh, setting spray which i don't like because it's like shooting out my face not really getting everywhere but okay guys um have a great day um hope you guys are all doing well bye